You got out of the way, I'm watching the game. Hi, I'm Veronica with Watchmonger.com, and today we're Ooh. speaking with comedian Steve Patterson on ways to be a good sportsman. My glasses back, man. So we're here ready to watch the game. What are you looking forward to? You know, the game doesn't start till, uh, till tomorrow, but I, uh, I'm in with security, so I'm, I'm in here about a day early, and I'm just looking really forward to the teams showing up. Let's go, boys! No one's here yet, but I just got to practice. Let's go, boys! Are you going to lead any chance with the rest of the fans here? I actually don't even know who's playing this game. I just got the tickets really cheap, but <laughs> I can actually support uh, any team. Well, I notice you're not wearing any jerseys. Is this because you will root for whichever team's winning? I should point this out to sports fans. It's great to support your team and stuff, but you're not actually on the team. There's no need to put your name on the jersey. Everyone knows you're not on the team. It's nice to have a little insignia and you can paint your face if you're seven or younger. However, I, I mean, I can do an interview if you like. I've practiced doing an interview as if I was on the team. If you want to, if you want to try that. If you want to okay, yeah, let's try it. Okay. Uh, so, how'd you feel about the game today? We just, you know, a lot of heart and we gave 110, uh, 110 percent, even though that's not, you know, even physically possible. So you guys didn't really pull through in this game. What are you going to do to make sure you win next time? You know, really dig down deep, give uh, give 110 percent. There's a lot of character in that room, and uh, you know, I go to the wall for these guys, and this is great. Uh, <clears throat> There was quite a lot of riots on the ice today. Um, are you guys just not getting along? I know a lot of people are against fighting in hockey, but um, I'll fight anyone that says they shouldn't be fighting. Can you give us some top tips to being a sportsman-like fan? Always wear the colors of your team, a jersey if possible, not with your name on it, no. Pick a player that actually plays for the team, that's a good tip. Certainly don't wear the colors of the other team, that's important. Participate in the cheers. I know a lot of people just sit there and when there's, you know, the organist has gone to the trouble of going, uh, <laughs> da, 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 da. Finish off the phrase for the poor organist. He's not getting paid, or it could be someone's iPod. I don't know. You should participate in the wave, right, which helps you circulate, right? As a fan, let's practice the wave, just you and I. Ready? Okay, you start. Yeah. See. Now, how much of an arsehole am I if I don't get up and there's only two of us in the game? Yeah. And I guess the final thing to being a good sport is if your team wins, you do get to gloat a little bit, but um, you know, don't rub it in too much because inevitably your team's going to lose again pretty soon. I'd probably stand on the chair like this and with my butt like right near his face and just go, what's that? That's a Drew Brees. That's what I would do. <laughs> there we have it. Some great tips. Thank you. Thank you and go team. Saints. <laughs>